Hi everybody, it's Michael back with more practical data solutions and today we talk about recovering Excel files. You know, the type of files that can drive whole enterprises forward and we all know how disastrous it could be if we lose an Excel spreadsheet and how tough it could be to undelete it. Well, not for recovery. It. Let's see what we can do. Microsoft Excel is one of the most popular applications from the Microsoft Office suite and I don't think it needs any kind of introduction because it offers countless possibilities of ways to organize, access and summarize your data in different ways. Thing is that the Excel spreadsheets are probably the most invaluable kind of data you might have at home or at the office and accidentally deleting or losing some of them might cause significant data loss or loss of any other kind of resources. Because of that, I want to show you a few very easy ways to recover Excel spreadsheets. We're going to start with the most basic one to recover an unsaved Excel document. I think this is by far the easiest method. And on top of that, very often Excel is automatically prompting you should it notice a temporary file that hasn't been properly saved. Could happen if your computer crashes accidentally while you're working on a spreadsheet, or if your battery of the laptop suddenly dies and runs out of power, or any other kind of ungraceful shutdown while you work on an Excel file and that's going to result into this. And the recovery is pretty easy. In Microsoft Excel, go to the File menu, open, then choose the recent workbooks on the left, and look for Recover Unsaved Workbooks. And hopefully, that will do the trick for you. If not, then let's explore solution number two, which is recovery from within the Excel workbook. That's another easy to apply solution, which is good to know because we may sometimes do changes and break some macros or harm the document in some other way. And the goal is to restore the file to a previous version. This is also easy to do. Go to the File tab, select Info, click the Manage Versions tab, and you're gonna see a log with all the previous autosave versions. With a little more luck, you're gonna be able to restore the file to the version where everything was right. Well, now it's time to look at solution number three, which is cloud-based and could work thanks to Microsoft's OneDrive. That's the third kind of solution that we review over here, but if you work in an enterprise and Office 365 is something that you use very often, could be your primary technique and it becomes more and more common feature to try. Microsoft have done really good job with OneDrive and its integration of Office apps and it has been designed in a way to keep previous version of these documents. So similarly to what we have explored in the previous solution, we can achieve recovery of earlier Excel versions from OneDrive. Go to your cloud account, select the file that you want to recover, check the available earlier versions and choose Restore. Alright, these were three really easy to apply techniques and in most of the time they work very well, but uh, so far we have been exploring ways how to recover to a previous version of our Excel spreadsheet. And now what to do if we have entirely lost access to our workbooks and the first thing we could attempt to do is to undo the delete operation if we have done it. If you accidentally delete a folder with Excel files, we can always try this undo feature or we might press Ctrl and Z if we use Windows Explorer and that's going to also undo the delete action. As a second good option, we can always try our good old friend called the Recycle Bin or whatever it's named in the operating system. Like in macOS it could be trash, in Microsoft Windows it's usually called Recycle Bin. So this is an area where the operating system stores temporarily files that have been deleted. Here's an example with the Recycle Bin. Just look for the deleted file, click and select the Restore option and the file would be restored to its original file path. If none of these options so far work for you and you have accidentally deleted the file or even worse, formatted the drive where it used to be stored to, well yeah, that could be pretty challenging, unless you have the latest version of Recover It, because our award-winning software can recover files from permanently deleted locations, even from formatted drives. And I'm going to show you now how we can recover a previously deleted, permanently deleted Excel spreadsheet from our Documents and Settings folder in Windows. Let's go! Launch Recover It, choose the drive where the deleted file was originally stored, and begin the scan process. And once the scanning operation is done, 
Just search for the file, select it, choose the location to be recovered to, and here we better export the file to a different drive because that increases the chances of successful recovery. And that's how eventually everything is back to normal. And this has been everything about this episode. Uh, what I can say is that I always would wish you to never ever have to experience any data corruption and keeping recover it around is significantly going to increase the chances of recovering any data corruption. Well, that's been everything about this episode and hopefully these few easy to apply solutions are definitely going to increase the chances of recovering successfully your lost or damaged Excel spreadsheets. And if there is another type of files that you want to learn more about, let us know using the comment section below. It's been a pleasure to have you around. Make sure to subscribe for more practical data solutions. I'm Michael and I can't wait to see you in the next episode. Bye!